The base of a solid is a circle of radius A. So this is a circle with radius A. And we have in every plane section perpendicular to a diameter is a square. So if we take a square here, So we put a square inside this circle. We want to find the volume of this. Well, first, the equation of the circle is x squared plus y squared equals a squared. The circle is centered at 0, 0. Now, for the height of the square, well, notice that this part right here is just y. And this is also y. So together, it's going to be 2y. Now what is y? Well, we have to go back here and solve for y. We'll subtract x squared from both sides and then take the square root. So y is the plus or minus the square root of a squared minus x squared. Now because we're talking about distance, we're going to look at the positive y. So 2y will just be twice the square root of a squared minus x squared. So now when we're looking at the area of the square, area of the square is side squared, which in this case, because we know the height, we also know the base, right? They're the same. It's 2y quantity squared, which is four times quantity a squared minus x squared, or if you want, four a squared minus four x squared. So now all we have to do is integrate this. So the integral is going from negative a to a. And then inside we put the area of the square, which we said was 4 times a squared minus x squared. And I'm just going to factor out the 4. Now we just take the antiderivative of a squared, which is a squared x, and then minus x, x cubed over 3. And that's going to go from negative a to a. Plug in x equals a, we have a cubed minus a cubed over 3. So it's that whole quantity. And then plug in negative a, we have negative a cubed plus a cubed over 3. Now, a couple of these things cancel or rather, not quite, so, so let's just move this further. So uh, we have a cubed minus negative a cubed. That's gonna be two a cubed. So it's four times two a cubed, and then negative a cubed minus a cubed will be negative two a cubed over three. Now we have to distribute the four so 4 times 2a cubed, and then 4 times negative 2 thirds a cubed. And if you want here, you can simplify. 8 is the same thing as 24 over 3. So 24 over 3 minus 8 over 3 is 16 over 3, and that's going to be times a cubed. And this is our final answer.